Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Chantel. This is my basic journey. I live and travel in my minivan with my dog Joey and we're currently in the Santa Fe National Forest in New Mexico. It's so beautiful here and originally I was going to leave this spot today. I wasn't even going to pick up my camera at all, but I think I'm going to stay one extra day. It was supposed to rain tomorrow, but that forecast changed and so there is a very little chance it's going to rain. So I figured why not stay one more day? So I'm going to bring you guys along with me because I've actually been here for a couple of days after I left Albuquerque, um, but I've been not doing a lot of anything, pretty much just catching up on editing and planning on what my next adventures are. I'm not going to be in New Mexico very much longer. Um, I'm leaving this spot probably tomorrow, and then there's another spot that I want to hit up before we go into Colorado. So I figured I would just bring you guys along with me, and if you're new here, please subscribe. morning so apparently I'm bad at picking up my camera but I packed up everything and we're getting ready to leave this spot I'm so excited for where we're going like I hope it's as cool and as fun as I like imagine it to be I feel like when you have this like kind of expectation I don't know it's never as cool as you want it to be say goodbye to the spot in the Santa Fe National Forest it's really great today it's supposed to be super windy Let's go. <laughs> Are you ready to get out of here, Joe? He's so cold <laughs> after I took him out of his blankets. It's um, 44 degrees right now. So that's exciting. We're not used to the cooler weather yet, huh? Yeah, we've been in pretty warm weather. And this feels pretty good to me, but let me get your blanket. Is that better, bud? Nice and bundled up. Alright, 
Let's get out of here. By the way, this road is not the greatest coming in. If you guys are gonna come out here, just be aware this road is pretty treacherous. You guys see how much that like dips down? You just have to go super slow and just like find the best path. Like this is just so crazy, hold on. There's a lot of roads back there and it's pretty confusing but there are lots of people camped out there so it's kind of easy to see where you should go you know what I mean but some of the roads are really bad so just be super careful and super slow Well, I've made it to my destination and this place is just as cute as I thought it was going to be. I am so excited to show it to you guys. I'm going to eat really quick. I found a Mexican restaurant that accommodates vegans here in Cuba, New Mexico. Um, but this place is amazing and it's $10 a night. It's like an informal campground that's around a coffee shop. Ah! I know. I know. It's like 
made for me. I'm kind of sad that I'm only going to stay one night, but I'm excited to get coffee in the morning. I was actually really lucky. The owners of the place were actually leaving as I was coming in. Um, they have like a mobile truck for coffee that they go to Albuquerque with, and I just like got them and told them, and they like lock the gate and everything. So if I was like two minutes later, I would have missed them, which is crazy. It's like synchronistic. We're going to eat this food that we got and then I'll show you guys around because this place is so freaking cute. <laughs> You're so cute. So this is Juicy Jitters. It's what their coffee place is called. And so this little thing over here is a bathroom. It's just a porta potty, but it's a bathroom. <laughs> and then they have all these cool structures. It's like art. This is seriously like the cutest place I've ever been. And normally, that little purple building in the middle there, that guy, that's actually an outdoor shower, which is not on right now because it is too cold. But this place is just so awesome. And for $10 a night, to have everything you need and to wake up with a fully functioning coffee shop. Like this is perfect. This is so amazing. So they had me park here. They told me I could pretty much park anywhere, but they said, hey, you can have this cement slab if you park over here. And normally it's for the Airbnb people. And so that schoolie they built out to be an Airbnb and they close it during the winter because it's just too cold. How amazing. I'm in love. They even supply you with firewood in case you want to have a fire in one of the two fire pits. Either that one right here or there's also one behind it that I showed you guys earlier. And they have like a little gathering spot. It's so cute. Oh my god. Good morning. <laughs> I'll be right back.
gosh, you guys, look at all their little chickens. Hi, chick chicks. sad story I it's almost eight o'clock so I was like when do they open this coffee shop <laughs> so I go online and like look at their actual Google page and they are closed Tuesdays and Wednesdays and would you guess it it's a freaking Wednesday today I was like dang no wonder they weren't open when I came through yesterday oh man and I have no water and so I cannot make my own coffee. And the closest coffee place is 72 miles away, which really sucks. <laughs> and it makes me pretty cranky because that means I have to drive like 72 miles in order to get coffee because I have no water because I forgot to fill up. Really, there wasn't anywhere to fill up once I left Albuquerque, so I kind of just drained all my water in the Santa Fe National Forest, and I was like, oh, I'm going to a coffee place, so I'll at least have coffee in the morning before I head into Colorado. That's right, I'm leaving New Mexico today and heading into Colorado, so I'm going to end this vlog here. <laughs> But I hope you guys had fun coming along with me, and if you do visit this place, make sure it's not a Tuesday or Wednesday so you can get coffee. But I hope you had fun anyways. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, and if you're new here, please subscribe below. I'll also put a link for my Patreon in the description box in case you're interested in checking that out and helping support my channel. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye!